Good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the channel once again, welcome to the delayed flight. Here there is something interesting. Let us have a look, why not? You don't see such things every day, the truth is. Uh, we speed up W and F6 and we can fly a little bit with the birds together. Yeah, this is nice indeed. Anyhow. The startup of the plane is not that difficult, the startup of uh, the 7674. And uh, actually other things are a little bit more difficult, so let us have a look. The logic more or less is the same, but there are some uh, differences. Okay, battery is on, there is also a cover. Uh, I don't think we have any external power because the airport is quite small. I have checked it already. If you have a look here, for instance, there is only traffic and nothing else. Auto. I will not uh, touch this. APU starter on. Good. All six pumps on, engine bleed is on, and tension valve I think it is by default on. And here there is another trap, both engines together, it is not the worst scene. And let us have a look here. So, engine seems they are running already and we are operational. Uh, however, there are other problems concerning the light setup and we will have a look. So, we can check that uh, our engines are running. Everything seems to be just fine. Now, if we release the parking brakes yeah so maybe not to continue not to continue because uh, this clip is about the startup of the 767 I prefer to have a look at the airport. We can set the parking brakes manually. To be honest, uh, I haven't seen uh, such kind of animation. And uh, maybe this is the most interesting part of the scenery. Yeah, this is uh, more than excellent. I think we will return to see more details of the airport.
So, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we will also have a look at the setup of the lights because uh, there are some problems there. And uh, as I said, another problem is that uh, this distance is quite small from the pillow until the panel of the 767. You see, it is a quite small distance. I noticed this and I said this already out to the clip about uh, the first impressions concerning the 767. But definitely if you want to have uh, a night flight you must arrange uh, your lights and this uh, was some kind of surprise. But anyhow, let us not uh, continue further. We will see these things later. Long story told short, uh, there is a little bit some problem with the camera settings because since this distance, as I said, it is quite close, isn't it? The distance from the pillow until the panel, we always have to arrange our cameras a little bit in order to have a look at least at the runway or at the taxiway or when we, we are about to land. And uh, the other problem is exactly this one. I mean, it is also a short distance until the door. This I have never seen in any other of the Captain Sim Boeings. This is a quite short distance. So best chance, best chance until here. You must make some arrangements until here. The truth is that continuously I change the setup of the cameras. And this is the bad news, okay, because if we are inside the cockpit, somehow you know. We must do our best to have the best visibility. This is good, it is not bad like this. And in general, you know that I use these cameras lots of times. Now, the good news is that there are so many excellent camera views from the windows. I have saved already a few I will show you. Yeah, this is really excellent. From the right side, this three. And from the left side, also this three. You see, this is nice. Indeed, it is nice. But still, I always have to change the three main cameras. In general, I always save three cameras for the cockpit. And at the moment, these are the three cameras. Actually, they are a little bit different, but it has to do with the landing or with the takeoff and so on. Uh, also, ah, Gatula, Edoine. Here is this this Gatula, this little cat. This little cat. We must bring our cat, maybe. And I uh, wanted to show you a little bit the tower. It actually is quite simplistic, I would say. But the truth is that uh, you have an excellent view from the tower. Yes, you do have an excellent view. And let us have a teaser, why not? This I recorded already. And it is not bad at all, I would say. Because uh, the view from the windows is really excellent. They are quite transparent. In other towers they are not. Yeah, that was nice. Let us have another view again. Yeah, the windows of the tower are really excellent. You see. I wanted to see... Let's see how the plane takes off. And it is just super. It is just suburb.
So, with this uh, takeoff, let us uh, end this clip. Thank you for watching this clip, ladies and gentlemen, and hope to see you soon in the next one. Good take care. Bye for now.